eat light, eat often. Have you ever gone to a party just completely hungry? And, and you then, just blah, 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 Yeah, make a beeline <laughs> straight for that buffet table. Your body's low on sugar and it wants food and it wants it now. If you're eating light. All day long. And you're eating often. Right. You're gonna avoid that type of situation. That's exactly right, Bernie. The other thing that I like to recommend is when you go to those parties, take a look at the buffet and build a peace sign plate, which is a balanced plate of a little bit of everything from your favorite foods. So check out our little peace sign plates here. Yes, we got the veggies and we got some dip and some cheese, but we've also got a brownie on the plate. I got chips on mine. We got some chips. So with this balance, you're gonna get a variety of nutrients, not too much of the need foods and not too much of the want foods. A nice, good balance. All right, Becca. But how about the drinks? I'm talking about the booze. <laughs> so, of course, some parties will have alcohol. And if you choose to drink, you should do so in moderation. So what that is, one serving of beer is a 12-ounce bottle. A serving of wine is a 5-ounce glass. And I highly recommend to people that you alternate a glass of wine with a glass of water. Th what this does is it helps you to delay dehydration, which is very important. All right. When it comes to the snacks, mm -hmm. whether it be salty or sweet, guys, you want to remember, all right, keep it, and I kind of loaded this one up, <laughs> but keep it to uh, no, no larger than your hand. That's going to really help you practice the portion control. That's a great tip. So you can have it all. It's just about having it all in balance. The last recommendation is to respect your fullness. And what that means is just we've all been to those parties where we've overdone it. We've gotten those big bellies and that uncomfortable full feeling. I have definitely been uncomfortable from time to time. And the truth is, like Becca said, you have to trust your own fullness. And that's going to help you avoid overdoing it. Right. Remember that parties are about the people and the food together. All right. So savvy social eating. You want to make sure that you're eating light and you're eating often. And when you're at that party, build that peace sign plate. And most important, trust your fullness. That's great. And of course, we can't forget that when it comes to the good life, it's in your hands.